Hi, good evening. Welcome to another sharing on number one products. The date is 14 of uh, May 2020. Yes, uh, it's past midnight. But I'm making this video to help to answer a few questions that came in the last few days. One of the questions was, what do you feed to your putes? So, P for pute, so I'm going to go through briefly. Now, I use number one deworm on my putes once a month for five days. This clears up all the parasites. Don't be fooled. When a pute doesn't eat live food, it still can get internal parasites. They can be transmitted by air, they can be trans transmitted by contaminated water if we don't keep our drinking water clean and top quality for the pute. It can be transmitted by air through water droplets, through dust particles, food particles at a microscopic level. A lot of the worms are invisible to the naked eye and they cannot be seen and we cannot assume that since it cannot be seen there's no worms so the deworm is the one that clears this out of the pute now without clearing the parasites when the parasites are inside the, the pute the bird itself when we give things like lava direct the vitamins for the pute the internal parasite worms will take a bit of this as well okay it will grow strong since we feed bird food you will also take a bit of nutrients from bird food and grow strong we feed fruits putes eat fruits we feed fruits the internal parasites will also make use of this and then what happens is when the internal parasites get strong they interfere with the form of the pute and we all know putes are extremely sensitive one small little detail that goes wrong the pute is not in good health it's moody it doesn't book out as expected so it's not only the vitamins that we boost or a booster that we put there are other things that we have to be concerned about which is the deworm the quality of the bird food and the fruits okay i don't have the apple and orange which uh, I can show you but I have the diagrams I can share with you now one interesting thing about putes that I do is for molting putes I give them this bird food which is the number one jumbo bird food okay the reason why I give them during molting is I do not demand high performance from a molting pute that's first thing second thing this helps them to grow feathers much faster than this so I let in a little secret I use this on my molting putes to speed up their feather growth okay I also use the molting food from time to time when I want okay I can give you more information on the molting food powder that one is applicable applicable to all kinds of birds okay putes jumbo shamas and huibis so I cover this on the putes later I will go through and show you what are the factors that actually go into a bird that makes the bird healthy it's not just this 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 and they don't work alone all this work together to help the bird so we have to be very careful on the different areas if we make a mistake on one of the areas it's going to affect the whole system which is the bird Okay?